Hi, I'm Lisa. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Today I have a Dollar Tree and Walmart haul for you. Can I speak? Uh, anyway, I'm filming in my room this time again because my son is gaming in the front room. But um, we did a monthly trip to Walmart and we stopped at Dollar Tree beforehand like we did uh, last month. And uh, I decided to do another combined haul because I didn't get very many things from each store. But I got a few a few good things. Let's start with Dollar Tree. It's mostly snacks again. So, let's see. Let's see what I got. Okay. I've been wanting to decorate my carts, the cart that I have books in. Um, so I went and got these. There was one with... Um, Pink flowers that I remember from uh, when uh, Sam and I went there for, uh, on my birthday, but I couldn't find them, so I just got th um, three of these, and they're um, embossed stickers. They're well, they're uh, te um, let's see, metallic. Um, but yeah, they're not flat. They're um, they're more three dimensional. So um, these will look really pretty on my cart. Uh, what else did I get? Um, okay. Um, my oldest um, has pick up. A couple of spoon rests. I have two of the silicone ones from Shop Miss A, but the thing is that because they're soft, some spoons um, or utensils you, you can't use them. They it won't hold because they're uh, they're soft. So we got a couple of hard ones now. Let's see what else did I get? Okay, there it's. Um. Are the rest snacks? I think the rest are snacks. And it's basically the same snacks I got last time except for uh, this. This is um, Godiva Chocolate Domes. I believe I've had these before. That They have, uh, in the middle they have like a very small like a Ferrero Rocher. And they're pretty good. So I decided to get another one. These were the only Godiva ch Chocolates that they had um, today for some reason. But I know I've gotten the other kind. And then I got another bag of peanut clusters. Uh, I didn't get these uh, last couple of times I was there, so I decided to get these again. And I also, once again, got the peanut butter cups. I love these. These are so good. And they and both of these are from Landmark Confections. And of course I had to get my tried and true, my orange slices. Now I know I can get them for a dollar at Dollar General, and I did um, a couple weeks ago. But I think I like these a little better. So anyway, is that it? Yep. Alright, now for my Walmart stuff. And um, I wanted to get what I needed to get, well, let's, oh, okay, this is something I already had. I had it in the car in case I got cold, so, but anyway, I got, um, three, no, I got two pairs of, two more pairs of Lee jeans. Uh, I believe these are size 20s. Um, normally I would get the... Capris. In fact, I'm wearing them now because they go like maybe just above my ankle. Because uh, regular length pants are usually too long for me. But these are regular pants. They're not capris. But these I can roll up the pant legs. So uh, I won't step on them. So that won't be a problem. Let's see. Anything else in here? Nope. Just the two pairs of pants. And I also got, uh, let's see, I 
All right, I got myself a. I needed to get a sweater or a sweatshirt that's that fastened or zipped down the front, so that way, if I want to wear it open, I could. Um, I'm still having moments where I feel a bit warmer than I want to, even during the winter. Even though I just turned a uh, couple years closer to 60. And uh, it has a yin yang on the front. And I think that's why I decided to get this because of the uh, yin yang. But they have one that had mushrooms. They have one that had, um, I don't know, I think it had the sun and moon or the sun or the moon or something like that I can't remember um but uh I went ahead and got this one and it's a kind of a rust red and it's got a hood and it zips all the way down the front and this is gonna this is gonna keep me warm and I won't have any trouble taking it off if I get too warm and the last thing in this haul is another very soft pair of pajamas. Uh, these are the bottoms. Uh, it's got the, uh, the plastic things um, keeping it together. These were on a, one of those multi-purpose hangers that hold the top and the bottom. But I love the pattern. It's kind of like a tribal pattern. And I love, of course, I love pink. And... They're elasticized on the bottom, which um, which is very helpful to me. As I mentioned before, I have short legs, so that works. And here is the top. And it's just so pretty, and this looks so comfortable. And I love this material. It's just so nice. And it came with its own pair of, uh, of um, fuzzy socks. I love this color, this, this burgundy wine color. Love it. Anyway, that is my haul. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know in the comments what else you would like to see. Um, if you have any of these things and, uh, what you think of them. And, um, also, speaking of Walmart, is it just me or are they phasing out the checkout aisles? Because the Walmart that we were going to, they seem to have way fewer check out aisles, and way more self-check. And that kind of makes me nervous because that's taking jobs from people and uh, I just, I mean, I know they're trying to, um, I, I mean, it's like, we don't want to pay these people, so let's just phase them out and they can go on and uh, find something else to do. Uh, I just, uh, are there any other stores you know of that are doing this? Um, there, there are quite a few stores that we don't have nearby, so I don't know what's going on, but clearly Walmart is, is, um, 86ing their, their checkout, uh, aisles in favor of not having to pay as many people. And uh, that just doesn't sit right with me. Anyway, didn't mean to uh, end this video on a depressing note, but that's just the concern. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this haul. And I will see you next time. Bye.